Hello, I'm Commander Y, and welcome to my Black Ops 3 Weapon Review. In this episode, I'll be covering the XR2. The XR2 is an assault rifle unlocked at level 1 in Creative Class. It's an auto-burst weapon with 3 rounds in each burst, so you can either pull the trigger once and fire 3 bullets, or hold the trigger down and the weapon will continue to burst on its own. Shots to kill. The XR2 will kill in 3 or 4 shots. This depends on how far away you are from the enemy. If you're at close to medium range, the XR2 will kill in 3 shots, or 1 complete burst. But at longer ranges, the XR2 will take 4 shots to kill. Rate of Fire The XR2 fires at 857 rounds per minute. This is fairly high for assault rifles, but remember, this weapon fires in a 3 shot burst and has a 0.2 second delay between each burst. So actual RPM is a bit lower. This means that you'll need to place shots accurately, pulling the trigger only when the time is right. Otherwise, an enemy with a fully automatic weapon might get the edge over you. Accuracy the XR2 has good accuracy. The recoil of each individual shot is fairly low, and the pause between each burst keeps overall recoil in check, but there is a bit of inconsistency about the weapon. Sometimes all three shots of a burst will fall into a very tight spread. Other times one or two shots will kick in a seemingly random direction. This usually isn't a problem at close range, but as the enemy gets further away this inconsistency may be an issue. Mag Size and Reload Magazine size is 30 rounds. This is a very standard magazine capacity for the assault rifle class. This also means that each XR2 magazine contains 10 bursts, which is a comfortable amount for a burst weapon. And when you do need to reload, it's pretty quick as well. Reload time is 2 seconds. This is in line with other assault rifles and fairly quick in general. It's worth noting that if you use the reload cancelling technique, you can reload the XR2 in 1.3 seconds. Now that we've gone over the major stats of this weapon, it's time. Let's build a custom class perfect for the XR2. This class will be focused on maximizing the XR2's potential with a number of powerful attachments. This class will also encourage a tactical playstyle, meaning that you'll stay behind cover as much as possible, but when the opportunity arises, you'll move quickly to take down enemies or capture positions. Finally, this class will be focused on securing high-level score streaks. Point 1 goes to the XR2, of course. Point 2 to an optic. Although the XR2 has usable iron sights, the ELO sight provides a much clearer sight picture, which makes targeting distant enemies a bit easier. Point 3 goes to the quick draw attachment. Quick draw speeds up the XR2's aim down sight time, making for a more reactive and snappier weapon. Point 4 goes to the high caliber attachment. This attachment increases headshot damage and with the XR2 this translates into one fewer shot to kill at closer ranges. That's right, with high caliber if you hit a single headshot the XR2 becomes a two shot kill weapon at closer ranges. Point 5 goes to the wild card, primary gunfighter 1. This allows for a third attachment. Point 6 goes to that attachment, long barrel. Long barrel will double the range of your assault rifle, meaning that the XR2's 3 shot kill range now goes out to ludicrous distances. And because we selected high caliber earlier, the weapon's 2 shot kill headshot range will be extended even further. Point 7 goes to the wild card, primary gunfighter 2. This will allow for a fourth attachment. Point 8 goes to that attachment, rapid fire. On many weapons, rapid fire is a less useful attachment because it has a minimal effect on rate of fire and increases recoil. However, on the XR2, rapid fire is much more useful. It heavily decreases the delay between each burst, pushing overall rounds per minute from 867 RPM to a staggering 1000 RPM. This is a very favorable upgrade and worth the extra points in this class setup. Point 9 goes to a secondary weapon, the XM53 Launcher. This is a free fire or lock on launcher that is very effective at taking out score streaks. In doing so, you earn points and support your team. And as a last resort, you can also use the XM53 against enemies. Point 10 goes to the only perk in this class, Annie Up. This perk will start your player with a 100 point bonus to their score streaks. This will make it much easier to attain lower level streaks, but also makes a difference on the path to high level streaks. To round off our class, we need a specialist. Because we're going for high score streaks, I recommend the Seraph and her combat focus ability. When this ability is active, a certain bonus score will be awarded towards your own score streaks. In my experience, combat focus seemed to double any score I was able to achieve. For example, instead of receiving 100 points for killing an enemy in team deathmatch, I'd receive 200. This also works for capturing objectives and a variety of other score provoking actions. 
Of course, we still haven't selected Score Streak, so let's do that now. I recommend the UAV, Talon, and Wraith. The UAV will identify enemies on your minimap, the Talon will assist in guarding your perimeter, and the Wraith will stealthily dispatch enemies, helping to tip matches in your favor. And that's it. That's our perfect class setup for the XR2. This concludes my Black Ops 3 Assault Rifle review of the XR2. If you'd like to be notified of when the next episode goes live, you can subscribe. But until next time, I'm Commander Y.